Hey everybody, it's Pat here and I am back. This is day three, tip number three for 100 ways to get healthier in the new year. If you've been following me since Wednesday when I started posting these tips, you'll know that they are coming from the pages of a magazine that I was reading at New Year's. And so I ripped the pages out <laughs> and I brought them with me because I wanted to share some of these with you. Hey, Sharon. And so tip number three today actually really hits home because it is something that I do. And the tip is to consume good bacteria. And the explanation under that is first to eat yogurt or take a probiotic to help prevent gastrointestinal and respiratory illnesses. And I firmly believe in that. And the one that I take is this. So people were asking me to share what I'm doing. This is the one that I use. So there we go. Yeah. It's available at superstore, health stores, and so on. So I take one of those a day. And I have been doing that for a few months, and I can feel the difference. So Elizabeth, hi. And Sharon, good to have you here. So that's tip number three is to eat yogurt and, you know, to take good care of your guts <laughs> really is what it boils down to. So people have also asked me, why am I sharing these tips? I'll tell you. It's really all about hashtag Wanda's legacy. Some of you know that my best friend, who was an entrepreneur as well, passed away last year uh, from cancer, my age. And if you think that didn't have an impact on me and caused me to sit back and go, whoa, while I have been on a health and wellness journey, that experience really caused me to ramp it up and to kick it up a notch. And she and I talked about it. And she said, you know, you've got to get out there and really speak to entrepreneurs because her comments to me were, if I could trade places with you, and those words ring in my ear and I take it very seriously. And so I'm on a mission to help you, those of you who are entrepreneurs and you know who I'm talking to, get a grip on your health. I'm launching a new podcast coming up in a few weeks called The New Face of 60 because I've had a lot of people saying to me, I want to be just like you. Well, it doesn't happen overnight, people. So start at age 40, start at age 50, start today. That really is my message. So today it's day three, tip number three, and I will be back tomorrow with another tip. Leave your comments below. We'd love to hear from you. And please hit the share button because these tips that I am giving you are simple, they're doable, they're effective, they work, and hey, why not start today? So that's it. That's all. Keeping it simple here and keeping it healthy. Go out and have a great day and enjoy the sunshine like I'm doing today. Bye, everyone.